Zimbabwe is set to pilot an injectable pre-exposure prophylaxis injection to 500 clients as an HIV prevention intervention after the country received 4,000 doses recently. The pilot program will be conducted in three provinces and selected sites as part of the research on the injection. In the following report, we give you details about the HIV prevention injection. Zimbabwe rolled out the antiretroviral therapy in 2004, and this has seen the country achieving remarkable gains in its HIV response. The country also went on to introduce pre-exposure prophylaxis in 2016, targeting high-risk populations. This is a scientific intervention that scientists believe is a key milestone in the HIV response. As the country moves towards the end AIDS goal, another prevention tool is on the cards, an injection. So the latest is now the injection, CAB LA, C A B L A, or Carbotogravia. This is an injection which is given every two months and can protect you from getting or acquiring HIV. So obviously it's for people who are HIV negative, but who feel that they are at risk of getting HIV. The drug, an ARV designed to suppress any infection as it occurs, is for HIV-negative people who have a high risk of becoming infected. The injection is effective in the, in the therapeutic levels. There are no shanda to prevent. So you get the first injection. And to get the, to the therapeutic levels where it then can work for two months, you have to have the second injection in the second month and every two months thereafter. The preventive injection is the third prevention intervention to be recommended by the World Health Organization after PrEP and Depivirin ring. And Zimbabwe faces a mammoth task to research widely on the injection before considering adoption. And it's not just for women or um, sex workers or men with sex, men, men with men, uh, sex with men. It's for anybody who feels that I am at risk, right? The issue is, obviously, we are going through some small research um, protocols just to make sure that we get it right because we don't want anyone to get infected whilst they are on this injection. To enable a smooth pilot of the injection, the Ministry of Health and Child Care is in the process of training health workers. We are training the health care providers. So I'll tell you that we have finished with Mat South. This week we are in Mashingo. And uh, we were hoping that next week we'll be in Arad. But definitely we're thinking that before the end of this month or early next month was we have started. It remains to be seen what impact the preventive drug will have. To many, the injection is a welcome intervention at a time the country needs all its cards in place. For ZTN Prime, I am Miri Ryan Singh. Konapo Konapo, Ipapo Ipapo pa ZTN Prime, DSTV Channel 294, the place to be.